hey guys so welcome back today in crypto we'll be talking about the latest crypto updates and what's happening around the crypto space first of all we have 1.2 billion watts of bitcoin as this coinbase to cold wallet it's actually a very crazy news that this weekend over 1.2 billion bitcoin just left coinbase and what does that actually mean it actually means that there's a in inflow a big rise in institutional investment and acceptance so be, one point one point two billion dollars worth of bitcoin left coinbase that's one of the most reputable crypto exchanges to cold wallet to cold wallet and that's actually being done by institutional investors and even lying with that still there is still bs in the last three last 24 hours we have seen bitcoin falling down from forty thousand dollars to thirty eight thousand five hundred dollars according to binance as of the moment so this moment has low all-time low for the day then we also have crazy one today the crypto market has lost over 80 billion us dollars today over 80 million us dollars have been lost today in the crypto market because of bitcoin dumb because bitcoin when it dumb all that altcoins also followed actually been a crazy one this weekend in the crypto market and we have coins like altcoins like ethereum xrp solana cardano doing extremely bad Ethereum has actually fallen from three thousand dollars downward to like two thousand eight hundred dollars. That's been a crazy one. Then BNB is struggling around the four hundred dollar, but it fell to three hundred ninety something dollars. So it's been a crazy one this weekend in crypto. And the BS looks like they have taken over. I might still see more downward movements. I still see more downward movements. We also have another news here. As the crypto market is doing badly, we actually the NFTs is doing very well. And we have a news here that global NFT trading volume grows over 200% in 2022. What it actually tells us is that the public has actually come to the awareness of non-fungible tokens and metaverse due to Sony celebrities backing and supporting it. And it has actually done excellently well. We have the likes of NFT Ethereum doing over 18 million dollars from two thousand in two thousand in this year january 2021 22 we had the global trading volume of nfts trading at 17 billion us dollars and as of now april 17th according to intro the blocks year to year daily date chart it tells us that over 54 billion us dollars have been traded on the nft global market that's actually a crazy one that's over 222 percent growth crazy one for nfts nfts are doing very well we have the likes of the bot ape and lots more then it's actually news yeah Metamax, Metamax actually dropped a tweet on their social media handle, Twitter handle, as of yesterday. And which what were they doing? They were warning the iPhone users, the Apple users, that is a iPad, iPhone, yeah, and that if you actually enable iCloud backups, which we you actually do that, yeah, they actually do that. You are that means your seed phrase is being stored online, and that's actually very wrong. You know, in the crypto space, your seed phrase, as far as your wallet, should be stored online so that someone else can't get access to it. But now, iPhone users actually. Actually, if you actually on your iCloud backups, it means that your Metamax wallet data is also been shown to the public. So Metamax is actually advising iPhone users using their platform, their wallet, that to actually disable it. I would actually advise you disable it because why they made that claim was because there was someone that actually made a tweet. We call him Revit Dom on Friday that over 600, 650 fifty thousand dollars worth of his digital set was what wiped away, was hacked, sealed to that similar method on his apple icloud so you actually have to be very careful iphone apple users if you're using a macbook macbook iphone or ipad please endeavor to disable icloud to backup we have an annual news here china launches metaverse labs yeah it's a crazy one so china they actually lost in launch a metaverse lab which is actually going to be used for research in the future of media technology metaverse culture and creativity and other metaverse fields so the chinese government the government actually going in big on tech in crypto then we have a news here the last news for the day which tells us that will shiba inu rally up to 0.005 dollar this week since this week and why is that actually a sentiment because in the last few days robin hood exchange one of the biggest exchanges also listed shiba inu and actually after that listing shiba inu did very well over 36 percent upward movement but we can see now it actually restrains over 18 percent downward downward and so analyst says that actually it can actually do that position and that will be over 100% movement.